Are we far enough from the Harambe situation to admit the zoo handled it poorly? They should have let the kid bite it? There's six billion people, but not that many endangered gorillas. Seems like a fair trade. And a good lesson in accountability for bad parents. Oh, so now letting your kid fall in the gorilla pen at the zoo makes you a bad parent? It must be nice to have never made a mistake in your life. Here's the thing, the zoo's not in the animal business. The zoo is in the, they're in the entertainment business. I think people are gonna be less likely to go to the zoo if they know that, like if I fall into the gorilla pen, I'm not coming out. <laughs> the gorilla's coming out. <laughs> you know, you're, you, you're paying for the presumption of security to some extent. Like, my ass would just simply not go into the gorilla pen, but I guess I'm smarter than the average zoo attendee. It does suck for Harambe, though. I mean, like, dude literally was just in the zoo, and then somebody else makes a mistake, and he gets killed? How is that fair? I mean, he didn't do anything wrong, right? Wait, was he holding the kid? I don't know. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> I hope, at the very least, I hope Haram Harambe is, like, haunting that kid's parents. Like, every night when they go to sleep, they get, they get visited by the ghost of gorillas past. He's rattling his damn chains and stuff. Jacob Marley style. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did... Click the like button. I've said a great deal. Of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. For now, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. See ya!